morning people it's about six in the morning we're off to birmingham today we're going to the great british eyewear show ants here i don't know if you can see them it's a bit dark so we're gonna go and pick up our other brother maz and then we're gonna bring amar and Brittany. so yeah we'll check in in a bit so we made our first stop off just had our full english breakfast so great british eyewear show First time that it's ever been put on, it's put on by Tom Davies. So we're going to see a few brands. We're going to do a bit of CET, that's continued educational training. Hopefully we can get a few of them, some interesting workshops. But yeah, catch you in a bit. They look hot though. That model retail for? That would be 2200 Woo! But if I can I borrow it to show you? For example, this is this is the detail that we that we put into these pieces. Yeah. This is what you used to ask me, isn't it? Chrome hearts. Yeah. That was a little preview of what we've uh, been looking at at the Great British Eyewear Show. Quite a few cool brands. We're just breaking off for a little bit of lunch with the team and then head back. So, peace. Blue, this is my eyewear collection. This is my first pair of glasses. This is Teo. As you can tell from all the glasses there, I'm a big fan of brown frames. This is what I'm currently wearing. Linton Chilterns. But these are not finished. I'd like to wear just a subtle tip. Kubram, this is what you've seen on the last episode. This is what I chose on that day for myself. This was a very special piece. This is what I wore in Santa Cruz. These are special members for me. But this was the glasses that I've always wanted. The Kazals, the 958. So that's it folks. It's the first time, like I said, that the show's been put. So it's not the biggest of shows, but we managed to get some really cool niche brands down there, which we're into. We managed to get some CT points, new opticians that haven't completed your cycles yet, time's coming up. Favourite frames at the show that we saw, Zales. 
love Kazao and Chrome Hearts. They were beautiful, very expensive, but beautiful nevertheless. Francis Klein took me by surprise. They're beautiful pieces. I can't say they're everyday wear. There's a time and a place for those pieces and there's a certain personality that can pull them off. Thank you for watching. If you like what you see, subscribe. Otherwise, peace out. See you next time. Yeah.